the, the book, first and foremost, came out of my experience. I've been, I've been traveling around the North American region for the last year, and what I found was that I was training people on digital marketing, uh, analytics, AdWords, I've even spoken on social media, created programs, and, and, and training people of all sorts, but most of the people in, in companies, some owners, and Twitter and social media is still a big question mark for people. How to use it, how to get a return on it, and especially Twitter. I, I've spent a lot of time researching this, and for the last couple of years, I've actually done some exclusive events on Twitter because there are so many people that still don't understand it. In fact, Twitter has announced, and it's a known fact if you Google this, is that there are 284 million monthly active users. Seems like a pretty decent amount, right? However, there's 974 million registered users. Now, that's a little shy of a billion. But if we look at those numbers and we do the math, 284 million divided by 974 million actually equates to a little less than 30%, more so 29%. So of all the registered users on Twitter, 29% of them actually use it and use it actively on a monthly basis. Now, the reason why behind this, and, and this is more of a theory in, in my case, is that one, uh, Twitter is not a very intuitive uh, social media site. Facebook is very simple. Um, LinkedIn is, is very simple as well. You understand it, what you do, you connect with people, you connect with past colleagues, current colleagues, people in your network. You can go on and find new people as well. And you connect and, and then you know that they see you and you see them and you can communicate that way. Very similar with Facebook. Facebook is more so you know, geared towards family. You do have some business aspects where you create the pages where you can really only communicate to them and they can communicate to you. And once they do that, then you can talk back to them. Twitter is a whole nother beast. It is wide open. You can talk to anybody. It's, it's very one-on-one, -on -one, interactive. People see a lot of it as a news uh, channel, almost in a sense, where you can get breaking news in the minute, in the seconds, which is the case at the same time, though, is that I've had people, and specifically clients and friends that I've worked with, that have had a number of success using Twitter as far as connecting and getting deals out of it. Now, it's not always directly through Twitter. It kind of starts off with Twitter and then leads to other avenues. But if it wasn't for the actual social media site Twitter, they wouldn't have never got there. And they never would have had those results and that, that would have not changed their business. And so I, I felt that I had to take it upon myself to provide a very straightforward guide to how to use Twitter. And that's where the book Chirp Chirp came into the play is that it, it's actually a how-to guide. It's, it's very interactive. There's some videos in there. There's links. Uh, there's homework assignments in there. But anyone who wants to go from the basics to advanced this book provides that, and it's phenomenal. I'm really, really excited to share with everybody. At the same time, I'm a little nervous because I've never done this before. I don't know what to expect. I really want it to be successful, uh, more so because everyone can use this, and, that, and that's the thing. There's so many people. 